Kathy and Lola have had a very busy week in the NewsHounds <laughs> World Headquarters. And we kick things off with what could be the end of the line. Here's this week's edition of the NewsHounds. And then there were three. SD wants you to meet Sudan, the world's last remaining male northern white rhino. He lives in central Kenya with two females, and since he's the last male, the fate of the northern white rhino species rests on Sudan's shoulders. There are no northern whites in the wild, and Sudan and the females are under 24-hour armed guard to protect them from poachers. If Sudan doesn't reproduce on his own, keepers will turn to artificial insemination. Fingers crossed. Lola says somebody's got to go on a diet. This is Jabba the Hedgehog, who tips the scales at nearly three times the weight of the average hedgehog. His previous owner had been overfeeding him, and he was so chunky he couldn't curl up in the protective ball if predators approached. Jabba loves mealworms, but is now on a strict regime of liquid food, one portion at a time. He's gone from four pounds down to 3.6, with a target weight of 1.4 pounds. Jabba's lost enough weight that he can once again roll into a ball. Good luck, Jabba. Esty says this is one for the record books. A proud sheepdog in Northern California has given birth to what experts say is the largest litter of sheepdogs ever, 17 puppies. Stella gave birth about a month ago and all are healthy. She can't take care of them all. Stella's owners and a handful of volunteers are taking turns feeding all the hungry mouths with a bottle morning, noon, and night. All of the pups are already spoken for. Lola wants you to meet Piper, a seven-year-old border collie who owns the runway at a Michigan airport. Okay, he doesn't actually own it, but his job is to chase birds and other critters off the runway. And on top of that, Piper's got swagger. Video of him doing his duty in some stylish goggles and a safety vest has gone supernova online, racking up four million views. His owner says he may look bad to the bone, but in Side, Piper is a lover and pretty good at his job, too. And finally, man's best friend is not too thrilled with his mechanical counterpart. Esty says the dog belongs to the owner of Playground Global, a tech startup company. Boston Dynamics created the robot dog, and as you can see, the real life Fido refuses to back down from the robot's encroachment. Hey, you ugly mutt, this is my parking lot. Get out. And that's this week's edition of the News House. <laughs> Good job, Esty Good Lord. boy. That's a creepy looking thing. <laughs> we'll be right back.